aphids are one of the most common type of pests that are very destructive due to their sap sucking ability so in this video we will see what are these aphids how they attack and how to get rid of aphids on any of your plant their proper treatment is extremely important because they can also spread from one plant to another very rapidly so follow all these steps and do subscribe to our channel First let's talk a little about their nature and basics. So aphids are the tiny soft body insects that have many colors like grey, green or orange etc. They attack on the new healthy growth of a plant in the form of clusters. They suck the nutrients containing liquid from the stem which is called as sap. While sucking the sap of a plant they also transfer viruses into the host plant which may result into yellowing leaves, leaf curl problem, distorted and stunted growth. Due to this whole thing, a plant not only dies but also the adult aphids can fly to other of your plants. So that's make them unstoppable. Therefore a proper and timely treatment is very important. Aphids attack mostly on a plant in their growing season when the temperature is also a little warm. Aphids likes a high humidity area where they move well over the host plant. You can easily identify them if you inspect the plant carefully. High density of host plants can also increase the chance of aphids attack because they like not to be disturbed while they eat and reproduce. Some of their favorite host plants on which they attack very commonly are roses, cabbages, cauliflowers, tomatoes and ornamental plants. And the chance of aphids attack is very high on a plant that is weak or under some type of a shock. Aphids attack can get real bad if not treated timely. Aphids are also the carriers of viruses and treating viral diseases is a difficult thing. Another thing is that they reproduce very fast and will be over your whole space on all your plants because they move from plant to plant. So overall aphids attack can be very harmful for your plants and that's why treating them timely is very important. If we talk about how the aphids reproduce, so their mode of reproduction is also very dangerous. Aphids have a female which gives birth to live young aphid without any type of mating. So this thing makes their population to explode very rapidly under favorable conditions. Also the aphids mostly multiply them below the leaves. Here if you find this video helpful, do subscribe to our channel. If you are not dealing with aphids attack right now, there are a few things you can do to prevent them. Try to choose only the healthy seedlings while they transplant, use a weekly pesticide spray routine, you can use Nemal spray, video on making and applying Nemal is linked in the description box and i button. Another preventive measure is that don't plant favorite plants of aphids in density. Try to keep your plants healthy so they can fight on their own. Also keep your plants in a sunny and airy spot and keep pruning for better and healthier growth. But sometimes our healthy as well as weaker plants do get aphids attack and for that you can follow these 4 steps. First step to treat aphids on a plant is to move our plants to an open area especially when they were previously in a closed area. This will help the plant to be at somewhere ideal. Just choose a semi shaded area with an airy condition and place your infected plant there. The second step of aphids treatment is the removal of most infected parts. As aphids attack in the form of clusters, so choose the most infected parts of a plant and simply cut them off. You can dispose this branch in an airtight bag so they don't spread to other of your plants. The removal of these infected parts will give a relief to the plant so it can gather some strength against the remaining aphids. And subscribe to our channel for more such tips and tricks. The next step of aphids treatment is applying a pesticide, means you can use pesticide on the plant. You can simply mix a tablespoon of neem oil in a liter of water. You can also buy neem oil from the description box link. And then add 1 tablespoon of liquid soap or shampoo in this water and mix properly. Now our homemade pesticide is ready to use. You can apply it over your whole infected plant. Just wash off the whole plant with this solution. Make sure to apply the pesticide on your plants at the evening time. This way you can use this neem oil spray every 3 to 4 days. Also give a gentle spray to other of your plants so they will be protected too. You will see gradually the aphids attack will be over until then use Nemal spray regularly. Once your plants are a little relieved now you should give them some fertilizer so they can overcome any nutritional deficiency happened while the attack. You can use this homemade and organic fertilizer that contains all the essential nutrients. Video on this fertilizer is added in the description box and i button. Just like aphids, there are also many other type of pests that can harm your plants and it's very important to prevent them. You can follow this ebook. It will help you control any pest attack over your space. Means no pest attack ever. It's linked in the description box, must check it out. So it's all about aphids and their treatment. To learn how to cure leaf miners on a plant, check out this video and don't forget to subscribe to our channel.